Dogs love taking in all the smells, and they're very good at it. Their keen sense of smell has made them invaluable to law enforcement and the military. But instead of sniffing out drugs and bombs, these canine noses have a different purpose. What we do is we use canines to track the presence of human sewage uh, pollution that gets into stormwater systems. Human fecal contamination is a serious environmental problem that can cause a variety of illnesses. It's a leading cause of beach and waterway closures in the U.S. Conventional water sampling tests take 24 hours at a lab and often must be duplicated to ensure their accuracy. Maine-based Environmental Canine Services trains dogs that can give an instant yes or no as to whether a location is contaminated with bacteria. They can actually discriminate between animal source, fecal pollution, and human. Calvin College in Grand Rapids, Michigan recently brought in ECS dogs Abby and Kenna to inspect samples from the Plaster Creek watershed as part of its ongoing cleanup efforts. The research we've done about it suggests that the dogs are possibly the most sensitive method there is. It doesn't take long for the dogs to detect human fecal bacteria. Good girl. It's a positive. Good job. Good working dog. Kenna's positive reinforcement is food. She's a golden retriever and she's food driven. Back east, ECS co-founder Scott Reynolds' dog Sable prefers a tennis ball. The 10-year-old German Shepherd Husky mix checked out stormwater system structures in a residential area of South Portland, Maine. We're particularly concerned about potential exposure of, of uh, swimmers to bacteria-laden water, and if that bacteria is coming from, from sewage, we want to know that. Tracking down the source of such pollution is a priority for local and state governments, putting these dogs in high demand okay. as they look out for number two. Mike Householder, The Associated Press.